So what's up? What's in your garage? Is up here in Tauri with long-term member Noel Gilmore, who's got this beautiful R107 that is actually uh, an AMG vehicle. Uh, when did you get this one, Noel? I've had it for over 20 years. Wow. Where did you find it? <laughs> At Foster. Oh, right. I looked everywhere and uh, all up in Queensland and everywhere for one and couldn't find it and then this one turned up in the street at uh, Foster, Good which is only Lord. sort of 25 kilometres from here. Yeah. And do you know what the colour is called? No, I don't. I've got no idea. Uh... It was repainted oh. in 1983. Right. I've got the photographs of it. Um, uh, the story of the car quickly is that it was owned by an elderly couple and they had quite a deal of um, car park damage down the side and they sold it to a young guy who owned a panel beating shop. Right. So he stripped it uh, totally and um, painted it. I've got a record of the painting um, as it was done back in those times. Got the original Becker radio in there. And what have we got on the clock on this one? 100 and, 100. 119,000. Yeah. Wow. Again, another car that's in great condition for that amount of mileage. And what motor do we have under the bonnet? We have a 350 V8. Has that it's been known... AMG'd? Um, well, I, I'm not sure. The difference is um, that it's it's been um, all re like painted under there. It's like two pack um, on the rocker oh, the covers, rocker covers yes. and all that. And the manifolds have been treated. You'll see. Oh yes, oh, they have not to, just yeah. the normal manifolds. Are they the go fast manifolds? Are they? Yes. What can we get from here? So this is 107. Just got weights on it. I can't see any dates there. Oh, here we are, 107. Wow. And the pad's very good as well. Wow, well, that's just so rare, isn't it? Yes. We were discussing that, uh, I know that Michelle Mallet's got an R107 AMG. Uh, then there's this one, and we don't know of any others in Australia? No, I haven't seen another one. All right. Yeah. Well, there might be one down in Melbourne amongst our fellow members down in Melbourne. They've got over a thousand members in their club, so yes. maybe there's one tucked away somewhere there. Yep. But um, the suspension, the which is all um, AMG, right. has the AMG um, plaque on the oh, oil springs and really? bits and pieces underneath, yes. Wow. And did it come with these wheels? Yes. And they were the wheels that they put on them, uh, brand new, in the AMG factory. Yeah. Oh, you can see the numbers on they there too. They were Italian wheels, right. but that's what they were. All had the AMG model, all had those Italian wheels. Beautiful. Beautiful. And then something a little more modern over here. Yes. Again, how long have you had this one? Uh, I bought it in 19, oh, sorry, 2005. So I've had it for five years. Um, 2005? No, 2005, 15. 15 years, yeah. yes. Um, it's a, a 190E, uh, 2.316 valve Cosworth. It has the Cosworth engine wow. in it. Wow, well they're much sought after, aren't they? Yes. These 190s are becoming very popular in the club at the moment. And it's full Recaro leather interior. Yeah, it is too, isn't it? Look at that. Beautiful interior. And again, a, a very well kept car. Here's all the details that you need to know. Can we have a look under the bonnet? Yes. Please, Noel. 
Certainly. Because uh, what lies beneath on this is quite important, isn't it? I'm almost expecting to see a badge on there. <laughs> so there it is, 2.3, 16 valve, eat your heart out. And again, congratulations on a very clean and tidy engine bay. Especially for that age, it's... Uh, yeah, it's, eat your dinner off with any of that. I bought it off an old fellow, with respect to being old myself, but an old fellow in Canberra. Oh, right. And uh, he'd had it for some years, and... Um, I've been looking and looking and finally found this one in Canberra so bought it home. And it's a it's a beautiful colour too. Is that yes. a that's that all a champagne original or? Yeah. That's yes, smoke silver. Smoke silver, right. Yes. Right. The classic wheels. Don't think uh, I doubt anyone sat in the back seat. So it doesn't look like it. Bucket seats in the back as well. That's a bit unusual. Shut him with a clunk too. What year is this? 1987. An 87? Yes. Wow. Well, well, that's an interesting collection for, uh, for what's in your garage. Thank you very much, Noel. Thank you, Vince, for taking the time and oh, uh, pleasure. coming up. Nice, uh, a nice collection to have. Lucky you. Uh, a couple of brilliant uh, uh, classics and yes. uh, some very nice, uh, slightly more modern cars. Modern, yep. All right. Thanks, Noel. Okay, Dave. I'll see you. Yeah, take care. Cheers.